Yo, what is up, guys? Kenny Game here, coming at you with some more NCA 14. And so, yeah, this is episode two of the Dynasty, and this is going into week one of our Dynasty rebuild. And so, our first team we have to play is Northern Illinois University. They are currently ranked number 24. And yeah, this is the first game of the season, and I'm really wondering how Heisman difficulty is going to treat me. For real, I'll probably do my recruiting too in this video, hopefully. But one thing I wanted to check out though with you guys is I wanted to get down our depth chart. I wanted to see like where's our strong positions, what can players do and cannot do. And so here, quarterback. Oh yeah, just to mention something though guys, the reason why I'm like talking so soft and like I probably don't feel energetic is because my mom's upstairs sleeping right now. So I gotta keep it down a little bit because the vent's like right above me so she can hear me. So yeah, problems of still being in high school. But yeah, so at the quarterback position, our senior uh, starter, but we gotta back up. To be honest, I'm probably gonna start Kenny Robinson because in 82 overall only one lower but a sophomore and a senior I'm I'm definitely gonna start the sophomore to get give him like more experience running back position we have we have a good running back position there and 87 overall 81 speed as you see he's not as fast as the backup guys but once this dude tears it up in the middle you can send these guys to the outside especially with this freshman with 91 speed Holy buckets. And he's already a re uh, freshman richer, so he'll be a really good. He'll improve a lot over this series. Wide receivers, 86, 82. The 86 is a junior, so we'll have him next year. Senior in Williams. And yeah, sophomore. Ooh, all right. Okay, so we got 86 and 81 wide receivers coming back next year tight end we have a good senior good senior tight end right there 83 overall on our left tackle 82 in our left guard 78 in our center 86 in our right guard and 82 in our right tackle so that's all middle low 80s right there so that's that's a good line right there defense so defense where it at we got 80 at the left end Right end 86, DTs you got an 85 and an 82, all middle 80 overalls. And then you got our linebackers 86, middle linebacker 88, which is a stud in the middle, and then 85 for the right outside linebacker. So as you see, we have a pretty good defensive core in all mid 80 overalls. The only thing though is that what senior, yeah. Yeah, the only thing is that all of them are seniors, so we'll be losing a really good senior core in that defense after the season. And cornerbacks, you got an 86 and then 83, which, yeah, that's that's on lock down the corners. 87, and then 87 for kicker, 85 for punter, and yeah, 98 kick return, 98 punt return. Yeah, so as you guys see, we got a pretty good squad. We got all... 80s you don't see any 70s and you also don't see any 90s but that'll work for me mid 80s is uh, is pretty good for a rebuild and so yeah i don't i'm not gonna show you guys or screw it yeah i'm gonna show you guys the recruiting in this video i'm just gonna show you like in like the first few weeks so you guys know who i'm trying to get and then once you guys like get an idea of who i'm trying to get then i'll like probably stop showing it because it I'll be honest, recruiting gets annoying in this game sometimes. But yeah, so these are who we looking at. Ooh, in 72 free safety I, is a must have. Redshirt him and he'll be at like a 75, 76. And then by his senior year, he'll be a solid high 80, hopefully. So yeah, just put some points into him. Is there any studs though that we're like, trying to get? Ooh, this scrambler quarterback right here, 70 overall. A 70 overall quarterback would be very nice. Put some points into him. Screw it, I'll put 500. I'll, I'll put 500 in this wide receiver too. Well, wide receiver I'm going to have. And then, um, 
Ooh, a 71 guard. 71 guard is good. Put 500 into him. Um, yeah, that's basically it. One thing that I, that I need to look at, though, for sure, is our linebacker. Our linebackers. Oh, yeah. We need some middle linebackers to replace those. Alright, so remove remove this prospect. Remove this prospect. Now let's go to all prospects and now let's go to some linebackers over here. Um, where's the linebackers? Right, they're outside linebackers. Any teams that are in any way a tiny bit interested in us? Uh, huh. Oh, what about this dude, Carl Mason? Put him on, and then let's go to middle linebacker. And let's try getting McKinley. Let's try getting McKinley. All right. So yeah, that sounds good for that. Now let's go add points to more people. Just start adding it to random people. Ooh, a 72 wide receiver. How did I not see that earlier? Oh, yeah, I'll take a four star. Ooh, a, a good, good pass block. Three star center. I'll take a, um, a 79 kicker. I'll take it. Ooh, black power kicker. Oh, hell yeah. Black kickers are where it's at. I'll get the outside linebacker. Um, and the 69 middle linebacker. Why not? Okay, looks good. Alright, guys. Uh, we are going to be starting our first ever game against rank 24 Northern Illinois University. Let's get it. I don't know if, if I told you guys this, but for offense, we are going with an Oregon spread, and our defense is the usual Iowa 4-3. So, yeah, I'm changing up the playbook. I will not use the, the Iowa Hawkeye playbook because they suck. I'm my own coach now, and I'm putting in the Oregon offense. So, yeah. Here is our top players going into this game, and here's their top players. As you see, they have a 93 overall quarterback and an 83 overall running back, which a 93 overall quarterback is pretty flipping good. Hi everybody, Reese Davis with you, bringing you the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 pregame show presented by Nissan. Beautiful Innovation day at Kinnick Stadium. Heck yeah. So what I like. Pretty cool little cutscene. That's the last time I'll be showing that in the videos because that took a while, and you guys probably want to freaking watch. 
We're going to kick. I always kick first. I love getting the ball at half. Getting the ball at half is fucking Iowa Iowa is ready to open this one up as they line up for the opening kick. Boom. This one's going yeah, to be down in the end zone for a touchback. More than Illinois staff and their fans have heard all week long, their quarterback's going to play terribly on the road this entire All right, team let's go. Starting the season talk. first on our open drive. Guy, he can go on the road and Pretty sure this is an 88 linebacker right here on him. Sometimes when you get some adversity like that, you see teams circle the wagons. Yeah, and I really nice. believe this week they've done it to win this game. Gains around Ooh, they're going with the no huddle too. All right. Shift just over to the left. He's got an opening. No, no, no. Get up. Oh, Makes thank God. He got it. They got him. I like how the ball. offense looked up. Sending an overload blitz. And he's tackled nice. around the 40 yard line. Here's the nice. I don't think he got anything on that. That's what I'm talking about. That's good D right there. Get him. Yes. Yes. Fourth and 14. Maybe he's not field goal range. Hopefully not. Yep. Punt. Heck yeah. That's what I'm talking about. That's a good defensive drive right there. On the 24 round. the deep man awaiting the return. Yep. Getting that in zone. Too much leg into that punt. They'll bring it out to the 20. The Huskies have a new head man. Hey, coaching new his theories, first game at Iowa. So let's see what the offense can do as they come out onto the field. All right, so I'm doing a read option here, which is probably stupid because I don't have a fast quarterback at all. Yep, that's good. Yep, first down the 12-yard game. Second play on this drive, I'm looking for a vertical seam. I might hit the tight end, cutting out. Yep, right there. Nice. Let's go. Hopefully, we can get him with this fake screen. And he might want it all get it, get it, get it. Does. Oh, no way. No. Option. Read option can get me three yards easily. Easily. Yep. Ooh. Oh, yeah. Right around the 20. Each time. Get in there, get in there. Oh, right down the at the two yard line. line. Dive right here, just power it in there. Yep, yep, that's a touchdown. First drive of the year. Looking good on offense, that's what I'm talking about. Field goal. Right up the upright. So a nine play, 80 yards for a touchback. The Team Hawkeyes defense, right 29 yards, one four well, average, what their coach talked one about, sack. Off to a get him, get him, get him, get him, get him, get him. Yes, yes, fourth and four, fourth and four. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I like. HB slope screen. Let's see how this works. Hopefully it works out good. Go, 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 baby, go, aw, oh, yep, he's he not fast enough, not fast at enough at all. More than enough. He's got an opening. Go, Makes nice, nine-yard rush, that's what I like. Yep, that's a touchdown, right there, 11-yard TV run, 14-0 on the ranked 2014 in the country. Holy balls. Give to the tailback. Yep, loss. A loss. Stop, loss of one. Third and ten. Let's go. Our defense is hype. Our defense is freaking hype. It's third and ten. Ball on their own 33. No way. No freaking way. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? It definitely put. 
It has and the they are making it. All right. The long field goal. Correct. Blitz. Blitz. I'm, I'm blitzing. Five guys will be out in the pattern as they're in the shotgun. Caught by the sophomore. No way. Inside no the way. To the 10. Tackled inside the oh, five yard line. No way. Oh my god. We messed up. We messed up. Oh my god. No. No, 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 no. Do not score. Oh. Oh. Go. Go. Oh. No. Do not catch him. Quarterback, I swear to God, if you catch him. If you catch him. Let's go. Hell yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Hell yeah. Let's go. That is hype. I would freak out right now, but my mom is sleeping upstairs, and I, if I wake her up, she will be pissed. Oh, yeah. Play by that's the awesome. Pick six in the other end zone. Uh, I'm score. pretty sure that's like a hundred and two yard uh, return. Pick six right there. That's why I like. That's Hawkeye. That's that's Kinnick football right there. A lot of gang so shit. So the offense will stay on the field and attempt the two point conversion. He's in for the conversion. Now I'm gonna be go with this stick play. I'm just gonna try to hit Clark hit down. Oh, oh! I, I think Clark's gonna be open. He airs it yep. out. Right there. Yes, Clark. Diving catch. He left his feet, made the catch, and managed to secure that it when he hit what the ground. That is what I like. That was just sensational. Jeez, I, it, am, is this for Sean Heisman? Cause I am balling right now. Ooh, a screen out to the team. right right here. Ball on the 15 yard line. Over the middle to his Get to the outside. Get to the outside. Bring him down. All right. The 10 yard so line. that one drive just burned the whole third quarter. So we're already we starting the fourth quarter. Up 22-3. And it looks like we're going to get a dub in this one, guys. Ooh, HB dive right here. This is going to work. Yep, right There's there. Another. Boom. Icing on the cake right there. Iowa's defense has just been awesome here in the fourth quarter. And the thing that's really stood out to me, Brad, is that when they've needed the stops, they've gotten them and got Boom. Three yard reception loss. loss. Really, they just had nowhere to go after the catch. Here's a quick throw. And oh, it's interception. Off. Oh, let's go. Right Defense showing up. Defense is showing up right there. Well, it's just one of those days for this offense. Already getting blown out. Now another interception. Can you imagine that walk over to the sideline? Now just line. some read options. So Iowa. simple. Up big. Oh, nice. Jeez, uh, my quarterback has 88 rushing yards, yeah, 3.5 average. That, that's pretty good for a like quarterback with like, what, 76 speed, I think it was. Inside zone right here, trying to put this game officially away if it's not already. Boom, touchdown. This is domination right here, guys. Domination. All right, guys. That was wonderful. I'm going to make sure after this game that I check the settings and make sure it's at Heisman difficulty because that was a blowout. I was thinking I would have had a lot more harder competition. But yeah, come into game stats, go to player stats. So my quarterback had 11 attempted, 9 completions, 129 yards, 81% average, 14 rushing though my running back 85 yards 6.5 average three rushing touchdowns what more can you ask and then receiving you got john clark 58 yards 19.3 average he was he only dropped a one and yeah his longest was 36 yards and he had three receptions is there any cool defensive things. Ooh. Rodney Maddox, he's 
he's 85 overall. He's our, what is he, our right outside linebacker, and he had five solo tackles. Uh, our captain, the 88 overall, had four. And then our free safety had three solo tackles. And so, yeah, so that's what the stats. And, yeah, so I really hope you guys enjoyed week one. Our first game was a blowout. We dominated. Hopefully we can keep this up. Maybe this isn't going to be an Iowa Hawkeye rebuild dynasty. Maybe it's just trying to win a championship. Just because, I mean, we don't really need to rebuild. Like, we're, we're pretty good. It's just that I'll, I want to win a championship, and then I'll be finally satisfied. So, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed episode two of this series. And, yeah. Next week, I think we have a bye, so I'm probably just going to be uploading the next video when we play. I think it's Iowa State, or maybe a team that's not as good. So, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed, and Kenny Gaming out.